so if you guys haven't seen already on my Instagram or my Twitter, I've been calling out someone to box. To box. Yeah, I want to box someone. Oh, what? Alright, so I've been calling out Javon Wanna Walton. If you guys don't know who he is, he's uh, an actor. You know, he's in the show Euphoria. He played Ashtray. And uh, he, he's, he was on the Steve Harvey show. You know, he, he's pretty famous. Pretty famous. But he signed under Big Paul's boxing promotion most valuable promotions mvp so he signed under their company uh he's a he's one he's one of their fighters and i'm i'm trying to fight him i'm trying to fight him on the jake paul mike tyson card now i've been trying to go out promote it trying to get him to notice now well, let me tell you with how i came up with this idea i came up with this idea after it was announced that javon had pulled out of his fight that was supposed to happen in September. So he was supposed to fight last month, but he pulled out due to being sick or having an infection. And I was like, oh, oh, this is, this is perfect. Cause November, he'll probably be fully recovered. And you know, we're both the same age. We're both the same weight. We're both the same height. You know, I mean, come on. I mean, the last two people that he fought were, were not, were not did not have winning records the first person he fought they, it was their debut the second person he fought was 32 years old when he was 17 that 32 year old was oh and one and one so i was like okay this is perfect this is a perfect opportunity i was bummed out when jake paul versus mike tyson was delayed to november because i was looking forward to it in july to watch it in the summer you know with the gang the gang man <laughs> it could it might have been a blessing in disguise because i'm trying to get this fight javon has noticed he has noticed these call outs i i i have confirmation okay i'm not gonna say who the source is but someone close to him uh has shown that he's noticed my call out also it's it's javon's dad's birthday today so i might as well uh, you know, give him a birthday gift with the biggest fight opportunity for your son's life, okay? Uh, you know, because Javon's dad is actually his trainer. So, you know, this this could be like a little birthday gift, this video that I'm uploading today on YouTube. I'm trying to fight Javon Warner Walton on the Jake Paul Mike Tyson card. Now, why? Now, Javon says he doesn't want to fight me because I have no experience. True uh and that because i'm a youtuber and i'm trying to get clout off his name just fight him just for clout partially true okay well yes this fight would benefit me it would kickstart my youtube and boxing career it also benefit javon in a big way too this is his third pro fight it's going to be watched all around the world live on netflix under jake paul versus mike tyson which means that the older generations and newer generations are all going to be watching this fight, coming together to watch this fight. This is going to be one of the biggest fights in boxing. So, this is the biggest fight opportunity of his life. Even if I'm a nobody, which he, yeah, he says I'm a nobody, but, I mean, who are the last two people you fought, bro? Uh, his excuse is that they have experience, but, I mean, oh and one and one If he didn't fight someone his own age... If he fights me, I'm someone his own age. I'm like half an inch taller than him. I have the longer reach. The same age, we're around 120 plus pounds. Uh, same height, I'm 5'9 and a half. He's 5'8 and a half, I believe. Another point that he brought up was that uh, that I'm just, I'm just a YouTuber. He doesn't want to box YouTubers. Okay, okay. But I mean, you're literally signed under jake paul's promotion mvp jake paul started off his boxing career fighting youtubers boxing youtubers he boxed deji and a nissan gib and now he says that jake was a youtuber turned a boxer this guy's just trying to fight me for you so why can't the same apply to me i'm a youtuber but i also want to be a boxer as well so why can't the same point apply to me i don't get it like this dude thinks that he benefited off of fighting on a undercard 
of Jake Paul versus Ryan Borland and a canceled Amanda Serrano fight. He's going to benefit off of this. He's going to benefit off of a Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson fight. There's not that many fights on the cards from what I've seen. There's only like three other fights that have been confirmed on that undercard. And this is a month. There's currently, it's uh, October 15th. The fight is supposed to happen November 15th. So we are a month away from the fight. I'm sure MVP, since he signed to them, can sneak in a little negotiation uh, in there. It's fine. This is not just about me, right? It, it benefits him as well. It benefits both of us. I I get to start off my career on YouTube and in boxing, influencer boxing. I've been wanting to do influencer boxing and boxing in general for a while. I Originally, I wanted to fight on Creator Clash 3. That's where I wanted my first fight to be. But, but uh, Creator Clash... Creator Clash 3 hasn't happened. I don't even know if it's going to happen. It hasn't been announced yet, so I still have that chance. If, you know, if I get this fight, I'll be known. And, yeah, I mean, I also wanted to fight. Like, this isn't the first time I've made, like, a short notice fight offer. I tried to fight Fox the G on the Prime Card prelims a week prior to uh, the Prime Card fight because he was supposed to fight Adam Sala and fox pulled out because his team suggested that he shouldn't fight adam on his first pro fight so i i tried to step in because we were the same age and the same like same weight same height you know similar with what i'm trying to do now with javon wanna walton but yeah i mean i don't see why he doesn't take this fight as a boxer he'll be known uh, around the world people will be watching him around the world Yes, most people will be there to see Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson, but they're going to be waiting, anticipating, watching the undercard in the meantime. So they're going to be knowing who Javon is. He wants to prove himself as a boxer. He wants to be known as a boxer. This is the biggest stage of boxing. He literally has the chance to be known around the world, streaming live on Netflix with like millions of people watching live on a Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson undercard with old and new generation watching. I mean, come on. I mean, this is literally, you, you have, you have the biggest fight opportunity of your life in your, th th in your third pro fight. I don't get why you don't take it. You can just say, I'm a clout chaser. Sure, sure. But that's not just it, bro. That's just not it. You benefit. I feel like you benefit way more than I benefit off this fight. Straight up, straight up. You're already famous from Euphoria and People from Euphoria, fans of Euphoria, are probably going to come watch this fight because you would be on the card. So you're attracting more fans and more people are going to be watching you. They're going to be there to watch you. They're not going to be there to watch me, bro. They don't even know who I am. But no one knew who your last opponent was either. I'm saying I'm a nobody, but you fought someone who was 0-1-1. And, and, and he was 32 years old when you were 17. Fight someone your own age, man. Fight someone your own age, same weight, same height. All right? You do that. Do that. Okay? I mean, jeez, man. Like, if you don't want to fight, you don't want to fight, that's fine. But at least give a good reason not to. And at least message me. Don't try to message on someone's behalf. All right? Don't get someone on your behalf to message me. Message me personally. If you don't want to fight, you don't want to fight. That's fine. All right? But the, 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 the reasons he's been giving... Is not valid. Oh, well, I'm a nobody. Bro, no one knew your last two opponents. Uh, I'm a YouTuber. I just want clout. You're under a promotion that Jake Paul... You're under Jake Paul's boxing promotion. He started boxing YouTubers. And yes, I'm a YouTuber, but why can't the same thing apply to me? Why can't I just be a YouTuber turning into a boxer? Or why can't I just do both? It's like... <laughs> It's, it's wild. It doesn't make any sense. It's a win-win. It's a win-win. I get to kickstart my career in YouTube and boxing. You get to be known all over the world in your third pro fight. You know, fans from Euphoria and fans... I don't get it. You get to be known. This is your biggest fight opportunity. Yeah, sure. I'm a no-name, right? So were the last two other guys you fought, bro. They were no-names as well. So, 
what's the excuse here what's the excuse what's what's the excuse i i don't have any experience the first guy you fought didn't have it was his pro debut this would be my pro debut so like i don't get i don't get what he's talking about i don't get what he's talking about it's just just clout chasing i'm clout chasing bro what <laughs> what 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 are you talking about man it's like it's not just about the clout it benefits you as well it benefits you it's your third pro fight and everyone around the world is going to be watching it like a lot of people didn't even know that jake paul versus ryan borland was even happening and that was you were under you were on that card and a lot of people didn't even know that that boxing event was happening so a lot of people didn't watch that fight a lot of people are going to be watching this fight so i i don't get why he doesn't take it but yeah uh we we have a deadline guys we have a month share this video with javon wanna waltz and maybe, maybe if he sees this he'll, he'll somehow be convinced through this video but i mean look if he doesn't want to fight he doesn't want to fight right i'm not going to try to pressure him into doing that but i i'm just listing out the reasons what he gave that was just not they they weren't good points they're pretty hypocritical all right so i'm just gonna yeah yeah hopefully i get this fight jesus